Hello friends, it's Kip Tsort from DT4EMS and you know, I was just having a little bit of a daydream and, and I was sitting here as I was going over some stuff here at work for DT4EMS, I wondered, what would it be like if Patrick Swayze were to be a DT4EMS instructor and be teaching our EVE classes around the country? Morgan, you're out of here. What are you talking about? What the hell is that supposed to mean? Huh? You don't have the right temperament for the trade. I'm telling you straight. It's my way or the highway. So anybody wants to walk, do it now. Hi, hello. Uh, a, a question. You know, I, I understand, sir, that you're saying it's either your way or the highway. When we're here talking about scene safety and self-defense for us on the job, what do you mean, sir, by, you know, your way or the highway when it comes to, you know, self-defense and keeping ourselves safe from, from these violent attacks? Be nice. Ah, I, I get that, but, but we're told we're supposed to be in control of the scene and we're supposed to have, like, this command presence like police officers, and so people expect us to control us, and sometimes we, we you know, we, we got to do what we have to do on the, on the street, right? I mean, you get that. Be nice. I'm, I'm sorry, sir, but one more question. What if, what if it's that, that person that, that, that's, you know, they're, they're drunk or they're high and they're doing that ridiculous thing where they're just laying down and they're faking it, you know? We, we, we don't want to hurt our backs trying to carry this guy down a, a, a flight of stairs on the stretcher when all he's been doing is drinking. You know, what are we supposed to do then? Ask him to walk, but be nice. If you won't walk, walk him, but be nice. If you can't walk him, one of the others will help you, and you'll both. Be nice. I want you to remember that it's a job. It's nothing personal. Look, look. I, I know I said it was just going to be, you know, one more question, but, but, but you know what? I, I mean, come on. The, what if this guy turns around and calls my partner or the female doc a whore while I'm standing there? Is she? I want you to be nice until it's time to not be nice. All you have to do is watch my back and each other's. So really what uh, Patrick Swayze is saying is something that we've been saying all along. That being nice is absolutely hands down one of the best self-defense tactics that we can use on the street to protect ourselves in healthcare, particularly in emergency medicine from violence. And whenever he's talking about, you know, watch my back and watch each other's, the idea here is to make sure that we're, we're protecting ourselves in all four areas. That's mentally, we're physically prepared for the stuff that, we, that goes on on the street, for the media that's both social and, you know, the mainstream media, and then in the courts, that everything that we're doing is going to protect us in the real court and the court of public opinion. Guys, you see how this stuff is on social media. We have to help each other. We've got to make sure that we're staying safe and we're being, we're being nice. And uh, that's the only way we're going to get back and change this culture and regain our neutrality. I'm Kip Tsort, and this has been an episode of Chronicles of the Culture Changer. I hope you enjoyed it. If you liked it, share it. We'll see you soon.